So today I'm chasing Spanish mackerel and I'm using a technique called down rigging. And what we do is put our live baits down to a certain depth uh, where we see the fish coming through on the sounder. The most important part for me is making sure my sounder is set up right. And on the Simrad NSS Evo 3, I've got the gain and the sensitivity dialed in really tightly so I can see every detail coming through the screen. So when those fish come through the sounder at a certain depth, I know exactly where to get my live baits down to and increase my chances of getting a good hookup. So, the conditions are right, let's get some baits in the water and see if we can get a fish. Okay, time to slow troll a limey out the back. And this guy, through the nose, put a treble underneath him and send him out. And just slow troll. Okay, I'm also going to put one on the downrigger. I can see some fish down deeper around 20 meters so that's where I want to put my baits like that it's tight bombs away we've got a fish at 30 meters my baits at 25 we should get a hit here it's clear as day on the sounder there we go. Yes! That was that fish at 30 meters. Just gotta keep the tension on him here. Get the downrigger up. Keep the fish on. Just saw that rod tip bounce. Jumped out. And this should be another Spanish. I could see him on the sounder clearly, down at 30 meters. And it was just having a look at the rigger which was down around the same spot <laughs> and didn't take long <laughs> for him to take a liking to that livey that was out the back there oh. <gasps> he's not ready yet yeah, it's pretty awesome when you can see that fish on the sounder clearly in the same depth as your bait and it's just a matter of time before they can't ignore a live bait sitting down there and they just have to eat it. And here we go, we've got a great result with another good Spanish mackerel. Oh, another fish on the downrigger. I've got to be careful there because there's a hook back behind him. There we go, should be safe there. You can see that's the importance of using the stinger rig you get a really good hook up, one in the mouth and one behind the fin and that's a really good result. Yeah. 